Hey guys, so tonight I'm going to talk about my time when I lived in China in 2012 to 2013. Uh, and I'm talking about the Great Wall. I went to the Great Wall, also I did check out Tiananmen Palace and the Summer Palace and the Temple of Heaven and various other places, etc. Which is pretty all cool places in Beijing area. Um, so the Great Wall, there's a rumor, like, oh, I mean, I've heard it from my brother, I've heard it from, like, you know, science fiction, that the wall was built on top of, you know, hundreds of thousands or whatever uh, souls, you know, who died building the wall. And I don't think that's necessarily true, I think it's a myth. Now, I could be wrong, I'm not a professional in this field, however, I have read some actual historical, you know, archaeological, you know, professor books that actually mention the reference and the misconception of during that era when people were assigned the uh, characters meaning wall, they were assigned, you know, to go work on the wall. And at the time, they considered it and associated it with a death sentence, death penalty, etc. So soldiers who were, you know, like, committing the worst crime, whatever, they would be sentenced to work on the wall. Um, and they would consider that like a death sentence, almost like a, you know, eternal, like, slavery, kind of like, to the death kind of thing. And so that's where it eventually became associated with, you know, they just sort of built it on top of the dead souls or whatever. Dead people buried them inside the wall. I don't think to date any actual mummies have been found underneath the wall in any of the sections that have crumbled or, you know, been deteriorated to some form or another. There's, you know, most of the wall is actually hollow. Um, and there's like sand inside or something like that, but there's nothing... I don't think they really actually did build the wall on actual people. My opinion mostly, also I gained from sources that I have actually read, and I don't think that's true, but anyway, the Great Wall was really awesome. It's kind of really cool that you can go on the wall and you can see as far as the eye can see in either direction, you can see the wall kind of following the top of the mountain, like a kind of like, kind of like a dragon or whatever, it looks kind of cool. Um, it was very exhausting. I remember that I was unable to actually complete the circuit of the area where I was supposed to go over the wall because it was too steep and I got too tired because I was um at that time I was not very athletic however I am now so I mean maybe one day I'll go back but yeah that's pretty much it I think I mean that's all I'm going to talk about for China and the Great Wall right now as I remember more or think about more I'm probably going to talk about more mm, comments are cool um don't think I really have money fellers but I'm just kind of doing this just because because it's fun I'm not trying to do this for, like, internet fame or whatever. I'm just kind of doing this because I think it's fun. Don't really expect to be internet famous. But, yeah, it's kind of fun. I'm, it's kind of helping me. It's almost like therapeutic. So, anybody gains any uh, information from this that's useful, that's great. If not, I'm going to keep doing it because I think it's fun. Anyway, have a good day, everybody, and checking out.